Hey there people, so I'm going to show you how to access Steam OS in Windows. And for proof that this is actually Windows, because some people actually think that I'm not really using Windows. This is Windows 8, not 8.1. It does work on 8.1, and I'm pretty sure it works on Windows 7 because pretty much all of them are basically the same. Well, for Steam, that is. Anyway, what you want to do is you want to navigate to your Steam folder. Mine's not under the regular program files folder. So for most people, what you want to do is you want to go to your C program files or program files x86 locate your steam folder and underneath the steam folder you want to find the steam um, program or the exe the application file then what you want to do is create shortcut or just right click create shortcut you're going to have something called steam dash shortcut in some cases maybe not anyway what you want to do is drag it to the desktop you can close out of that and then what you want to do is you want to go to properties once you get the properties then go to target and press space hyphen steam os without any other spaces then what you want to do is hit ok now i'm going to start steam without steam os first because it's a little bit interesting how to, to show it so it's mine starts off in big picture mode by default so when you start up steam god obviously is going to connect and then it's going to look like this like a regular version of Steam Box or big picture mode. Now what you want to do is exit Steam and then start this EXE which has Steam OS at the end of it. Now it should say that you're in a beta at the top over here and Steam actually thinks that it's running Steam OS which is interesting. So that's a little fun fact there. Also, there are a few bad things with this because um, I found that you can't change a few settings that you can in regular big picture mode, but in but to be honest, you really don't need to change them half the time, so it's fun to mess with, and you don't need Linux apparently, and it actually works with most games. It doesn't have any problem with any of the Windows games on here, so that's actually very, very interesting how it works and plays. You can do streaming, but I have no streaming set up because this is actually my streaming machine, so I can't stream anything. But yeah, that's just a little fun fact that I found that I haven't really seen anybody talk about yet, so hey, worth a shot to play with, right? <laughs> 